Hey everybody, welcome to another one of Chris's beer reviews. I am super stoked to introduce a brand new beer from the Flying Monkeys Brewery in Barrie, Ontario. It is called the Smash Bomb Atomic IPA. It's got a lot of stuff written on the box. I'm going to type it all up for you. You can check it out in the description down below. Same old typical Flying Monkeys cap. One thing that I want to show you is that under every single Flying Monkeys, Flying Monkey Brewery cap, on any of their beers, they have a message. This one says, always remember that you are unique, just like everybody else. Drinking it out of my Hobgoblin glass here. Let's see what it's like. Now, I want to say something. This is a glorious day for me because I love any beer from Flying Monkeys Brewery and I love almost every, any IPA. Very pungent, very citrusy, very grapefruit uh, aroma. Got about half a finger head there. Looks very much like an IPA. You got a very, very cloudy, um, almost mahogany looking color. I would even almost say, uh, um, can't come up with the other name. Very good. Now, IPAs are a very acquired taste. <clears throat> Somebody who wants to try an IPA for the first time, if you don't like hops, I wouldn't try recommending this. This is something that you drink after you've developed your palate um, to IPAs. This is very, 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 very interesting. We have very dark, fruity undertones in here, like very many of the uh, Flying Monkey Brewery beers. Um, very, very many hops. Um, just read something off the back of the bottle here. Smash Bomb Atomic IPA flares with flavor from the bizarre Citra hops. <coughs> Brewed with a strong crystal malt backbone, the fiery body of this brilliant ale gleams with light, warning this effulgent and flavorful IPA ruins you for lamer beers. <laughs> it's true. Very true. It's a, I don't know if I mentioned this, but it's a six point. It's a 6% ABV beer um, and 355 milliliter bottle. Man made madness crafted barely under control. Very good beer. I've had this just recently. I cracked open a six pack and it's been great. One thing I love is it tastes the same from the top to the bottom. So, what kind of a review would like I like to give this? Uh, sorry, what kind of a rating? Well, for beer drinkers like myself who would like such a beer, um, I would give it like a 3.9 out of 5. It's really, really good. Really enjoy it. Um, it's right up there on my list with their um, Optical Illusion Almost Pale Ale. And, uh, yeah, very, very, very good. Highly recommend it. It's a little story just to, to add here is that something that's really funny is that I I went to LCBO yesterday and I saw it on the shelf and I asked them, you know, how long has this been here? And they oh, it just came out today. So I went back today um, to, to pick up another pack because I wanted to show it with my girlfriend and uh, they were gone. So they're flying out those doors with them monkeys. So if you search lcbo.ca or whatever it is you go, um, lcbo.com, look for this if you like IPAs. One thing I would like to, to add is that it is not a syrupy IPA. I don't even really know what kind, I like, what kind of East Coast, West Coast IPA um, I'm looking at here because the hops are so potent and so powerful that it's it's, a, it's, a, it's more different than any other IPA I've ever had. I can taste like a lot of fruits in there, a lot of melons, um, a lot of different types of things going on in there. Highly recommend it. Uh, if you read the box too, they have a huge, huge description of, uh, of what's in uh, the beer. So check it out. Anyways, uh, thanks for joining me on another one of Chris's beer reviews. Don't trick and drive, but drink responsibly. Cheers.